Hello, you all. You already know what we're about to get into. We're about to get into these messages and see what our other hand would like us to know at this time. We about to get into these messages and see what our Elohim would like us to know at this time. We got the two of wands. The nine of swords and the judgment. So it's, it's being decided on whether somebody should stay or go. Um, it could be a touch and go, possibly with some type of illness or something like that. Somebody could be under judgment for the underhanded stuff that they've been doing. Somebody might end up in a hospital or they is in a hospital. This person is currently in a hospital and the decision is being made whether for them to um, stay or go. This person is battling some type of illness here. This person is under judgment for the underhanded and deceitful and deceiving things that they have done. This person is definitely in a hospital. This person might end up passing in a hospital. person might end up transitioning this person been trying to resist the ending though they ain't ready to go they've been trying to resist that But it could be this person's time. We got emperor to the death again. They've been trying to hold on. But this is something that's going to be successfully fulfilled. This man could be a Scorpio or an Aries, a Sag, a Taurus, a Leo, um, a Scorpio or an Aquarius. This person is going to transition. This person been trying to manipulate death. This person could have even made death offers like death magic. And now this is this person's karma here with the Wheel of Fortune. Loss. Because this person was doing that for greed. It's this person's karma to suffer. This person was doing all of that for greed. All these attacks. For greed, abundance. Getting it from the uh from old Lucy. Doing some cruel and evil shit. This man could also even be a Capricorn, and this is justice being given. You gotta balance out. So this man is about to um this this man about to lose his life from doing death magic and shit and making offerings against people. And in attacking people's divine abundance and stuff. So now this person is about to go to their cruelty and their oppression. Justice. But I tell you, this person fighting like hell. This person don't want it to be the end. They is fighting, though. They've been fighting that angel of death. Trying to manipulate. Trying to, um... Make offers, you know, emotional offers. But um, 
Nope, it's time for them to separate. It's time for them to separate and they holding on. They resisting that. They trying to, they they resisting it to the point where they even trying, oh, get out of here. No way. No way. Man, they in this position and they, no way. They in this position and they still making offers to the devil. No way. No way. Is this person in that position and still make it? No way. Yo. Yo. Whoa. I done seen it all. This is why this is justice. This person is... Man, wow. Wow. That, I, I'm speechless. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, wow. So, um, this person, they either is these signs or they got these signs somewhere in their chart. Scorpio, Sag, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Taurus, Aquarius, Libra. This person is still trying to get an opportunity for the, like, dang. So this person got to learn a life lesson. And, mm, mm, mm. He a fighter, though. So let's pull a grateful heart message because it's always something to be grateful for because this person ain't going to be able to attack nobody else with that death magic and manipulation and Whatever he been doing, ain't going to be able to do that no more. Ain't nobody going to be, tra- be able to travel to him anymore to cause no negativity. Because he done for. This magician is done. But he fighting, though. But like I said, it's always something to be grateful for because... This person ain't going to be able to hurt nobody else. And as you can see, this man wasn't looking for no no salvation or nothing like that because he in his predicament is still trying to make offers to the devil. Like, so, yeah. Unfortunate, but these things are. We have happiness itself is just a kind of gratitude. Yahweh will give you thanks for you answer me. You have become my salvation. The heavens declare the glory of Yahweh. You go before me and follow me. You placed your hand of blessing on my head. Yahweh has heard my supplication. Yahweh will receive my prayer. Yahweh upholds all those who fall. We are so often caught up in our destination that we forget to appreciate the journey, especially the goodness of the people we meet along the way. 
appreciation is a wonderful feeling. Don't overlook it. So most definitely be appreciative of whatever this is because this person ain't still making them offers for no reason. They was getting them before. They were stabbing a lot of people in the back before. At least 7 to 11. At least. I am overwhelmed with joy in my Yahweh, for he has dressed me with the clothing of salvation and draped me in the robe of righteousness. Righteousness. So people was definitely getting saved from whatever this is, whoever this is. Be strong and take heart, all who hope in Yahweh. Never lose the opportunity of seeing anything that is beautiful, for beauty is Yahweh's handwriting. A wayside sacrament, welcome in every fair face, in every fair sky, in every fair flower, and thank Yahweh for it as a cup of blessing. You prepare a feast for me in the presence of my enemies. You honor me by anointing my head with oil. My cup overflows with blessing. So do we need to know, um, do we need to know the actual sign of whoever this is? Okay. Is this a person a Libra? No. Is this man a uh, Capricorn? No. This man is a Capricorn. But he can, all them other signs that I named, he can have those signs placed somewhere in his chart. Or he could have been in the energy of those signs, you know. Doing whatever he doing. Because he got some type of skill that he use. And it ain't working out no more. Judgment has been called. People are being rescued from this negativity and manipulation. So, I hope you all got a message from this read that will help you along your journey. Know that Yahweh loves you. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Peace.